Hello everyone, welcome back for more Let's Play Final Fantasy Legend 3. Now, we take the fight to Ashura, who has been in boss and then downgraded. Very sad fate for Ashura. Hop over the hole, get attacked by a monster, and these monsters are a little stronger. You may wonder what's going on with the busybody on the on the right. Those are lips. Giant, magnificent freaking lips. It apparently uses to gossip. So let's um And the gossiping will actually cause confusion. So let's go ahead and take them take care of them first, just to uh just to uh, eliminate the threat of falling to confusion. You'd think that the mushrooms would be a threat to cause some type of effect, and I think they can cause sleep. Either way, both of those conditions are solved once you get out of battle. And there we go, we found the blackjack. No, not you, cat. We found the whip called the blackjack. It is actually much, it is actually very strong. Well, let's see, I don't think there's anything else on this floor. And just four mushrooms. Luckily, this is not the longest dungeon in the world. It will take time to get through. Ah, oh, there's some poison. I think we will actually have to clear that after battle. I think poison persists. But we get level ups. Something hadn't happened in a while. Does poison not persist? Apparently not. Oh, okay. No, no uh, persistent poison. This is good. So now there are a couple of treasure chests we want to get here. This was only two enemies, so we could finish that in a round. So now, if we're gonna do this, we're gonna go up and grab, or at least look at the treasure chest here. We get some TNT out of it, but maybe you've noticed that we cannot get back out of here without falling down. There's no way to hop over that. I wish there was. But there's not. Oh good, they ambush me. Get rid of the evil eyes, just in case. When you get an opponent named Evil Eye, that kind of makes me think, ah, oh, that's going to make me... That's going to paralyze me or stone me or something like that. Oh, they can they can cause sleep. Good to know. Sleep, I believe, also yeah, it clears. Go 
going to get rid of... Actually, let's use Crash. Why not? <sighs> Fireball multiplied. Yay. More fire! I wonder if the chickens from Lands of Lore are behind that. Probably. That's more XP. So you might have noticed things are a little more difficult in here. I would say you want to be at least level 15 before you walk into this place. At least my estimate anyway. Let's see, easiest way. Big empty room here just leads to the next staircase. And this place. Yep, this is the final boss room. Like I said, not the biggest place in the world. So we threaten return the units. And the sure said, oh, we already moved those to Chaos's castle. So that kind of um that kind of points to yes, Chaos is the one that raised that castle out of the water. And Ashura threatens to give us something else. And has some help. So what we can do here. Lantern will dance for you! Uh, let's... Also notice that's 800 damage that just tanked. That Ashura just tanked against us. Had about a thousand damage. Lantern strong against fire, and Lantern automatically repaired 28 hit points of damage. Lantern will still do the, the river dance on your face. Let's uh, let's make this worse. More river dancing on Ashura's face. Both of them. And we cast Wind against Ashura, because Ashura likes fire. And there goes Ashura. So the only thing Ashura gave us was a few gold, some experience, and a key. Unfortunately, they get to multiply. We are going to be able to take down at least two of them per turn here. It's like two and a half, really. So if they just keep multiplying like that, we're gonna, we're gonna, we could have been in trouble. Not much. I mean, they don't hit very hard. And luckily we have some holes to fall down to cut the travel time out of here a little bit. Just a little bit though. Good 
good old counter. The Black Knight is a very serviceable mech, especially in this game, apparently. They don't want to let us go without an extra fight. It is going to take us a moment to get to the other place. And by minute, I mean we were right freaking there. I forgot it was that close. So. <clears throat> no need to cut the video here. We can just kind of walk straight in there and be really freaking annoying about things. Because, well, we've done pretty much everything else. We could have gone somewhere and stopped off at an inn, but... Why? We're, we're in good shape. Just saying. However, here we do have to deal with, um... We do have to deal with, um... Conveyor belts. Yeah, missed. There's a hidden room in there. We don't need what's in there, but we, we've still got conveyor belts to dance with. And these, I believe, are one step up from the last group we met. Not much of a step, but it is still a step higher. here we cannot carry any more elixir which which makes me sad because elixirs are nice to have but we do have a full stash of them we can just let this carry us up the little roaming things on the walls there don't actually do anything as far as I know they're just there to look annoying or intimidating like you're being watched and if you walk in front of them you get zapped or something but no nope, nothing like that anyway going down that um, conveyor belt gets you absolutely nowhere so don't take it There are a few more um, floors to this to this uh, castle than there were in the previous one, but not many. I like the fact that it did absolutely no damage whatsoever. the gold shield actually let's put that on you for reasons 
Gold shield is drops is common. And I believe, if I'm not mistaken, yes, we need to go this way. Since we're already up here, let, let's get attacked by enemies. That's clearly what I wanted. all parts and we can't get any more relax which is sad but we can jump over those come down here to what is essentially a hidden pathway and receive an earth stone the more of those we get the happier we will be in the end And now, let's see, there's not a lot to this floor. And unfortunately, we stepped on this just as we, st just as we get attacked. Which means it's going to make the next part a little more annoying. This is what chest I want to get. There we go. Okay. So, up. You may have noticed the conveyor belt we are about to step on is going to lead us to uh, fall down a pit. So we can just jump over that and not mess with that particular conveyor belt. Even though we don't need to go that way. I forgot. The the doors the doors to the north east. I walked extra steps in this place. I did not need to do this. We do not need to go this way at all. Oh good, I'm feeling the sneeze coming on. This is fantastic. Now we could have come to this palace and cleaned out the first half already. Because here is the locked door that we would not be able to get past if we had not beaten Ashura and taken the key. So now here is a rather... Here's a chain of stairs we're going to have to take. But we want to make this little detour first because we find the Psy armor. Which I'm going to equip on Mage for reasons. And then we're going to get attacked. This may be a bit longer of an episode. Oh 
Oh no, we took six damage. We took another six damage. Whatever shall we do? This little section, when you first look at it, oh giant meat that we will not be eating. This section looks a little bit confusing when you first see it, but it's really just, you have to go through, you really don't have a choice, this is a fairly linear little, um, yeah, no more soft. The fairly linear little section, you just have to figure out where the stairs are, and it's not too hard to find them usually. another group we need to finish off here. Now oh, we can go in here. There is a shortcut back to the first the first staircase on that floor right there next to those stairs we also notice you can see something moving there that's the boss we, we need to get there but to get there we're going to have to uh, travel travel back and forth a bit also iron ladies which is the uh, lower level form of the Venus robot that lantern turned into still kind of sort of looks like a black knight just with a <clears throat> bulkier chest so so we will continue to say lanterns in a black knight although I believe the lantern said there's another mech that it more closely resembled called the Hermes but the Hermes is kind of a weak mech and that's and uh robot that uh, lantern is is not weak not by any stretch of the imagination we got some gold armor I'll take that oops Kicked on the first one that popped up. You were about to pass by the door we want to get to. Yeah, it doesn't matter if I attack here, I don't think. So I'm thinking it's at least two rounds to get through everything. As long as Lantern attacks an undamaged one. And now we have a fire shield. Which, given we gave Mage the other good shield... So we've gotten some... we've gotten some increases here. Increases are good. Let's see, if I'm not mistaken... What I've got there... I don't 
think there's any other treasure on on route here until we get to the boss itself. I was not paying attention to who got attacked. Probably mean just goes an extra round just because I was not paying attention. Yep. You sneered for seven damage. That the sneer hurt more than fire does. That's interesting. And now we are at the we are at the next to last door in this in this uh, dungeon. Doesn't mean it's not going to take a while to get to the boss, even though it didn't. Boss is like right here, just to see. You know what? Just because, let's go ahead and heal up some, let's go ahead and heal up. No reason not to. And Chaos here wants to know why we're gathering the units. And we say, we tell him the truth that we want to go back to the future. And Chaos said, your future's lost. And now, you are, basically. And if we were appropriately leveled for this, for this, uh, fight... This would be a very, very difficult fight indeed, because he does hit for, he can hit the group for 150 plus. He can do things like stone. Unfortunately for him, we, we are not um, appropriately leveled for this dungeon. We are all faster than he is. And he did 287 to star there, which isn't even... Okay, it is a quarter of her hit points. So I'm not gonna bother to uh, heal that one up unless we get hit with it again. <clears throat> but in the meantime, we win. Normally, that would be a very difficult fight if you were appropriate level, but I am not. Sadly, beating the boss does not does not uh, manage to clear out the enemies in the place, and we still have to walk out of here. Which I believe when I do walk out of here, I will call this video. As we are effectively finished in this finished in this uh, section, and it's time to go. It's just about time to go back to the uh, back to the Talon. There we go. We got the hover. About time to go back to the Talon. Install our new units. Things like that. Oh no, Lantern's magic is down. Oh, the sneer also confuses. Oh well.
So I'm going to be walking out of here. But once I walk out of here, we will go ahead and call the video. I really wish I had a way to fast travel to the entrance. There probably is one, and I just don't know it. Which is really annoying to think about. For many reasons. Granted, I'm not about to turn down the extra XP this gives me. Luckily, we can skip most of this floor. Still gonna have plenty of fights. Don't worry. They, they made sure we had plenty of fights. It hit two times, but missed. I think it hit it, just didn't do any damage. If only more enemy groups would be just one enemy. That would be kind of nice, really. We've reached the first half of the castle again. Enemies are still tough, though. A good time. I spent a good bit of time painting that armor, man. You know how expensive white lacquer is? Oh, wait, this is the gold stuff. Never mind. I wonder if anybody listening to this will understand what I mean when I said that. Thankfully, holes. Holes that do cut down some of the travel time here. Uh, was it this one? I think it was this one. No, it wasn't. We do have more holes. Thankfully, the exit right here. So, with us having escaped the castle, with the units in hand, time to call the video. When we come back, like I said, it will be time to get back to the Talon. At least I think so. And um, install our new units and see where we can go from there. So until then, take care everyone.